Baby girl, so bad like Riri. So bad like Riri. Baby girl, so bad like Riri. Turn it up loud, I'm telling you now. Got your love on repeat like a CD. Bust down on my wrist, all VV. Okay, so she was eating pears and I'm gonna just give her a bath in my bathroom today because I wanted to be steamy here because she seemed like she's trying to pick up a cold. So I kind of want the steam to kind of like open her up some. So I'm gonna get started on her water. So her bath is prepped. Um, I did let her sit in here for a little bit while it was steamy. I'm gonna also give her this. Um, this is good for immune support period. So I gave her this maybe one time, but I'm definitely going to start giving her this once a day. Um, this is black elderberry drops, so. There are two different brands that I use. I used to use this Cetaphil one, um, but I realized that it kind of just made her skin a little red. And I don't know if it's because I used it when she was a newborn or if her skin just didn't like it. Um, but I don't use that anymore. I use the Aveeno Baby. Um, I think it has oatmeal or something like that in it, but it's washing shampoo. And then I also use this Honest Kids body wash and shampoo. She has two separate, separate washcloths, one for her body and one for her face. And as y'all can see, I can't see. She likes to splash me water, she loves water. My butt finna be wet and not already. Yeah. It's okay. So, yeah. I'm gonna just let her enjoy this warm bath. And I don't really need to wash her hair. I wet it a little bit, but I'm gonna leave it alone today. I'm gonna leave it alone. Usually I will wash her hair and then I would um, let it dry. And then of course, you know, oil it and all that good stuff. But. And then this is a little the thermometer to let you know like how how warm the water is and stuff like that. So this is really cute. Cool. I'm gonna just leave this in here. But yeah, the water isn't too warm. She likes it, so that's good. <laughs> Are you enjoying the water or what? 
I wanted to get the little cup that like, you know, when you're rinsing the baby off, you, um, it's like silicone or soft when you pour it, uh, you know, it doesn't hurt their forehead or whatever, but, um, I haven't, uh, I don't know. I just feel like using a regular cup is fine. And I was using a cup, but today I feel like I don't really need to, I don't know, like it's, this is fine. Using a regular is fine. Are you all right? is the Freedom Mom brand. Um, I don't know if I did a review on this or not, but I definitely can if y'all are interested. Uh, comes with a little hook for you to hang it up on the door or wherever to let it dry and just sit for storage, I guess, which is really good and convenient. Um, comes with these little, this little flat thing. It's like a back support. This is like a pro and a con type of thing because it's like, it's not really convenient because it's like a soft, like flabby, as you can see, I can bend it. So I'm gonna go ahead and start washing her up now. But yeah, um, this is for newborns up to, I think 24 months. It's basically like a grow with me tub. Okay, baby, let's wash up. Yeah, I know, I'm definitely changing my clothes after this. Okay, the little princess is out of the tub. Yeah, the little princess is out of the tub. <laughs> we gotta wipe your face, but but. All right, so we gonna get lotioned up and put our jammies on. And put our jammies on. And put our jammies, put our jammies, put our jammies on. Put our jammies on. Let's put our jammies on. <laughs> That's how you feel, Bubba. Okay, okay, let's go, let's go. Let's put our jammies, put our, put our jammies on. Go marching down to the ground to get out of the rain. So she's all lotioned up and got the jammies on. Usually, um, after I put her, I'm saying usually like I'm not or didn't already do this. Usually after I put her jammies on or before I put her jammies on, um, I find what I'm about to put on her for the next day. And, um, my crazy self didn't show y'all the lotion I used before I threw it away. 
but because uh she just ran out and i need to go get some more but anyway um it's the shea moisture coconut oil um body lotion and it's really good uh on her skin it smells good it's soft it's 100 percent coconut oil and um and i use a hundred percent um virgin olive oil in her hair for moisturizer i don't put any uh like what do you call it i don't put any ponytails no you know harsh styles and stuff in her hair because i want it to grow out and i don't want it to get any like strains and i don't want her to get stressors around her edges so i kind of just let her leave her hair out like this for majority of the time <laughs> yeah bubba tell them say my hair just be out in my little fro yes it do and she wears her little bonnet to sleep don't you yes you do then put your bonnet on as you could see she, or as you saw she usually watches um i put on little educational videos like counting uh or like singing abcs um which i highly recommend either gracie's corner or super simple songs those all are really good for uh educational purposes um for babies even like little nursery rhymes girl you need a bib um and she'll either like sit on my bed or lay with me and watch it or she'll uh sit in her crib play with some toys for a little bit until it's time to go to bed ain't that right and she'll either sleep with mommy or she'll sleep with she'll either sleep with mommy or she'll either sleep in her crib by herself but it's up to her and how she feeling and all that good stuff but yeah if i want my mommy i'm gonna sleep with my mommy but I think the water kind of, you know, helped tire her out a little bit. And then right before bed, um, she gets a bottle. And that's pretty much her routine for the night. Anything else you want to tell the people, Pumpkin? Hmm? You want to tell the people anything? No? <laughs> Juicy? Please excuse my bed, y'all, because I washed clothes and I didn't fold them yet. And yeah. That's what you got to tell the people. Say, turn the TV back on. I didn't play the video for, you know, copyright purposes, but you know, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye bye. You got to look at the camera so they can see you. Say, give us a thumbs up. I don't know if she's uh, going to bed anytime soon. I'll try to record her going to sleep for y'all. Because this girl thinks she's supposed to sleep with a bottle in her mouth every night. And I don't know why. <laughs> Mommy don't know why. She probably like, this lady is crazy. But, um, yeah, give this video a thumbs up. Say, give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Look at her trying to turn around. Hey, 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 hey. Let us know if you want us to make a mommy and me channel or a channel just uh, strictly her and, you know, everything about her. Because I definitely make that happen. I know I look at how mess, y'all. The next time y'all see me, I'm going to be looking more decent because I know I look crazy. But it's been a rough day. And Pumpkin... Yeah, Tootie Pop. I don't like when the mommy baby sick. <laughs> mommy don't want the baby to be sick. Say bye. <coughs> Say bye. Also, usually right after she gets out the shower, I usually clean her um her nose and her uh pumpkin. You're gonna be showing all mommy goods. Her nose and her ears and all that good stuff. Ouch! Having a baby with nipple piercings is, is the struggle is real. The struggle is real, cause you be tearing mommy stuff up. It's not funny, but yeah, y'all, it's just her little jammies. 